If you do a quick Google search on whether you can do your MDS in the USA after BDS in India, you will get answers like, no, you have to do DDS first. It's not possible. You mean a certificate course? Oh, like MPH or MHA in USA? Forget about it. A degree is not valid. But hold on. What if I tell you that it is possible? Yes, you heard that right. It is possible to do your MDS degree in USA directly after doing your BDS in India. And no, I don't mean certificate courses or MHA or MPH. I mean master's degree in various dentistry branches in the USA. Keep watching to find out more. The process of doing MDS in USA begins with proper research. First, you have to find out which colleges offer masters without DDS but with the BDS degree obtained here. This information can be easily found on the websites of the various schools of dentistry in the US. To make sure you understand properly, in this video I will discuss about a renowned school of dentistry that offers masters in several courses to internationally trained dentists without asking for a DDS degree. The college that I am going to talk about is Ohio University School of Dentistry. If you look at this overview of postgraduate programs for dentistry available at Ohio University, you'll see that it has various requirements that prospective candidates should fulfill. But this column here, which reads non-US Canadian school dental graduates accepted, is our area of concern. You'll see that it says whether international dentists can apply in the postgraduate programs of the college or not. Departments like oral and maxillofacial pathology, orthodontics, periodontics, prosthodontics accept foreign trained dentists without them having a DDS degree. There you go. There is your proof that yes, US schools do accept students on the basis of their BDS degree. To understand the process further, let's look at one of the postgraduate programs. In this case, I have decided to concentrate on the periodontics postgraduate program offered by the university. The periodontics postgraduate program is a master's plus certificate program that lasts for 36 months. Each year, the Ohio State University accepts four students into this program. International students who carry a BDS degree are accepted and on successful enrollment are given a yearly stipend of $11,520,000. Seems great, right? As amazing as the program is, the process to get into this program, especially for foreign trained dentists, is extremely challenging. So as a foreign trained dentist, how can you get into this program? Let me tell you. First, you'll have to fill an application form worth $1.50 and attach some very important documents like your CV. Your CV should be exceptional and should highlight your marks, extracurricular activity and an acute acumen for research statement of purpose or intent, letter of recommendations with at least one letter of recommendation from your college's periodontal department, English proficiency requirement, TOEFL or IELTS score reports are required. TOEFL Minimum acceptable score in TOEFL is 595 on the paper-based test or 100 on the internet-based test. IELTS Minimum acceptable score is 7.5. Your NBD or INBD score is required and will be considered as a part of your application. All relevant document transcripts should be submitted in their original language along with English language translations that follow the format of the original documents. English translations must be certified by the issuing institution or a certified translator. Remember, due to high competition, these programs demand exceptional profiles along with relevant clinical experience in the USA. So it is advisable to enroll yourself in some fellowships or externships in the US to gain some clinical experience in the country prior to applying for these courses. As for the cost, it costs anywhere between $120,000 to $150,000 to do the postgraduate program in Ohio State University. So there you go, I have laid down one of the master's program open to international BDS students. Likewise, there are other programs in other universities that offer direct admissions to the master courses without doing a DDS. Some examples include the Rutgers University and New York State University. You can learn more about them by going on their official sites. So there you go. If you are a foreign trained dentist whose degree is not accredited in the US, don't worry. Follow and learn more about the steps mentioned above and you'll be fine. Hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you like, subscribe and share. Thank you and good luck.